Whoa, what is that? Oh my gosh! What is that? Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to Don't Star of Shipwrecked. We're back here with Wilson to play a little bit more. Now, I've actually kind of jumped a little bit ahead in this game. Uh, last time when we were playing, I ended up getting killed off. I think it was day 9, possibly day 10, I'm not entirely sure. Um, so I thought I would kind of skip the very beginning part and get to the point where I'd already kind of established a little bit of a camp for myself. So I have one here that is built up. I have our science machine, our alchemy machine, a couple of chests, although it looks like I could actually use some more. Uh, a little bit of a, a crop that I put in here, but that's pretty much it. Uh, we have our, our little raft here, but it's getting pretty damaged, and I kind of want to upgrade to an actual boat this time around so that we can put uh, some sails and stuff on it. Uh, last night, I was attacked by the Crocodog, so we survived that the same as we did in our first playthrough, but something interesting happened this time. All of my flowers turned into evil flowers. I had all these flowers planted over here so that I could catch butterflies, and I'm not sure what happened, but they've all turned into evil flowers. And it seems like the whole island has gone that way. So even down here, these were all normal flowers until last night. There was like a full moon or something. And now they've all turned into evil flowers. So I don't know what to make of that. Or even what will happen now at this point. I mean, it looks seems like the butterflies still spawn. Oh, look at that. There's Something keeps killing off the spiders out here, too. I don't know what it is. Maybe the, I think maybe the snakes and the spiders have been duking it out. So I've got all these... Uh, all these spider glands that I've been able to collect, too, and I should probably turn those into some sort of... Ooh, that's gonna go bad soon. Uh, I should turn those into some sort of, like, a healing salve or whatever. Um, I have six of them in here. Here's another two. It does seem like they don't go bad, too, which is nice. So, uh, but we do need ashes to do that. Oh, we just got a carrot from our little, our little crop here, which is cool. Um, there's some more seeds. I'm gonna plant those, and we'll grow another crop here, I guess. Uh, this one little farm plot's not really doing a ton for me, but um, it should at least give me some stuff for the the the, uh, the crock pot. And actually, what I want to do today is uh, work on building up my crock pot again because I did have that before. I got lots of rot here too. I can fertilize with. Um, actually, I should use this and I can fertilize the um, fertilize the vines that I have over here. So I've been planting some bamboo and some vines. Uh, I've been planting flowers. There we go. What I don't have on this island is any sand, so I can't plant any palm trees, unfortunately. But we do have a pretty good pretty good crop of everything else here, pretty much. There we go. Uh, so those all grow, and those will all be very helpful. Um, but I'm going to need to make uh, I'm gonna need to make a torch, I guess. Because we need to get ashes. Uh, I don't want this uncooked, so I'm going to hold on to that. Um, we're going to need ashes so that we can make uh, the healing potions out of it. And then we're also going to need charcoal so we can make our, our, uh, our crock pot. Uh, but I want to find an area of the forest that I can set on fire that's it's not just going to char the heck out of everything. So maybe if I can find a little spot down here. And actually for ashes, these uh, these plants down here would do well. Let's just set this on fire and see what happens. Oh, a little burn. There we go. I do have uh, I do have a, a good stock of bamboo already, so I'm not really too worried about setting bamboo on fire. But this should give me some ashes that I can use. I think I pick them up fast enough. Like so, thank you very much. It's almost night time. We're gonna start a start a little forest fire here and try to get some charcoal. I'm not sure if this is gonna spread to other trees or not. But it seems to be relatively far away from them. Ow, that hurt. Oh, now we got a little spread. That's good. Okay, get my axe out. Let's let me get some charcoal. I really want to build a, a new boat today, too, so I can put, like, a sail on it. Because I've been finding that it's just... Oh, man, if you lure them into the fire, it looks like... Ouch, that hurt. Um, okay, let's put this on fire. Hey, you're so hungry. I know, light that on fire. Come here, snake. Into the fire. I thought with the, with the fire you could actually actually kill the snakes because it looks like there's, there was some roasted meat back there but not anymore I don't know doesn't, doesn't seem to be hurting them anymore so uh, I'm a, oh boy that's really dark um, my torch is going to run out soon I should really build I don't have enough to build another where's my camp ah. okay found my camp I need to put some where's my okay you know what run for it Whew. okay that's going to be a problem I don't have oh no Run for it! 
It's so dark. I'm just going to have to run around and hang by these little fire pit things for the night. Oh, that is just great. All right, hold on. Hold on. Uh, regular campfire. Whew. Man. That was a waste of wood. But it kept me alive, so I guess it's not, not a super big waste. Good lord. Let's cook this on here. A little bite to eat. I didn't get damaged by anything, too, which is good. Uh, but I do need to go back and get that charcoal, and hopefully the ash that was down there hasn't gone away. It probably has, unfortunately. Alright, the charcoal's still here, so that's good. Grab that. Okay, what am I missing to make another torch? Twigs. Okay. Twigs have been a real problem on this island. I planted a whole bunch of them, but they took a really long time to grow, and I need to plant more of them. Uh, and actually, that reminds me, I have I have a few more here I can plant. Just do them in a big line, I guess. At some point, I'm going to have to put down a lightning rod. Make sure these things don't all catch fire on me. That would be really bad. But for now, this will be a good supply of twigs. I have to look up what happens when you pick evil flowers. Because that seems to be all I have now. Oh, actually, no, look, they're actually converting back now. That's a regular flower. Do they turn back or do they stay evil? That is a, that's a good question. Okay, for the food, do we have enough for the crock pot yet? No, crock pot needs six charcoal, so I'm gonna need I'm gonna need another torch. Let's go flambe the forest a bit more. All right, crock pots. Uh, we need more. Of course, we need more twigs. Always with the twigs. Uh, I need cut stone also, uh, which I don't have enough stone to do. That's awesome. Oh wait, no, we ha we can't make cut stone. Okay, so I've got the cut stone that I need, but it's the twigs that are going to be the problem now. Those things are just like the bane of my existence this time around. Okay, there is an island up top here though, so um, this is where I've traveled so far. I started on this island, collected some coral here, sailed over here, and head down. And I actually found a message in a bottle that has shows that there's a, a treasure down here that I'm going to have to go and try and dig up too, which isn't too far away from this island, but I kind of wanted to get my situation set up a little bit before I went down there. So I'm going to head up to this island. There's a couple more twigs left on there. I can grab, and if I think I have a shovel, I do have I have a shovel. So using, oh boy, this this, this poor boat's gonna, gonna sink itself soon. Uh, using the shovel, I can dig up some more of them to transplant. Uh, but I'd like to get enough twigs too that I can make a proper backpack, because this uh, this little thatch pack that I have on just, just doesn't really cut it. Look at that, I found a dolphin house, and it's got a whole row of little dolphins hanging over inside it. That's really cool. I didn't make that one. But it does look pretty neat. And what do we get do with those things? Do you like train them somehow? And they serve you as like, oh, what do we got here? Oh, right. So uh, there was a life jacket here, but I can't put it on or it'll drop my pack, and I kind of need the pack. Uh, spyglass, I feel like could be handy, except that I just don't ever even carry it right now. It's just not a priority. More like food and the supplies are. I've, I got these fireflies, though. I don't know what to do with them. I'll have to figure that out, too. Right, it's getting late. I'm running low on light. Um, I'm probably just going to camp here for the night as opposed to heading back home. And I'm hungry. That is not good. Okay, so I can set up a campfire and I did find some limpets. I also have a whole pile of coconuts here that I've, I've gathered up that I can make use of. So let's make a little fire here. Uh, preferably somewhere where I'm not going to set everything on fire. And then we'll take these coconuts. We'll throw them down. Um, I should probably cook, cook and eat the limpets first so I don't lose a whole bunch of health. There we go. I'm gonna chop up these things. My <laughs> bird landed right on the fire. How is it not burning? I feel like that should that should automatically give you some cooked meat. Well, that's an unexpected development. The tide is rising and it's encroaching on my fire. Uh, I hope my fire lasts through the night without getting drowned out, because that would really stink. In the meantime, I'm going to scarf down as much of this coconut as I can to try to get my health back up. And my hunger. Alright, we're good. Oh, don't put my fire out. It's like right there. It's right here. I need to sandbag it. <laughs> you can actually make sandbags to block stuff off, which is, I think is actually really cool. There's so much detail in this game. Um, but if, in case this thing goes out, I can't make another one. Run for the big house. Run for the big house. Oh, the pig turned his light out. Oh, of course the pig turned his light out. 
Whoo! I hit a torch. Oh, I forgot I had that. <laughs> oh, I thought it was toast. There's my wet ashes. Um, I hope this torch lasts. I mean, I don't have a whole lot left of the night, at least. Oh, that was close. I almost died. I don't know if it would have done enough damage to kill me, but definitely it would not have been comfortable. Oh, we made it. That was close. That was just a, a little bit too close for comfort. Oh, it's windy. Uh, and I can see stuff blowing away. That's funny. It's all going off in the water. All right, let's head. Uh, let's head back down to. Actually, do I have enough twigs on me yet? What have I got on me? I have six. I have just barely enough twigs. Although the tide's going back down again. Uh, I don't think there's any more on this island I can pick though. Now they're pretty much. I've pretty much cleaned this place out. So let's uh, let's take the raft. We'll head back. Head back down to our little homestead. Such as it is. Whoa, what is that? Oh my gosh! What is that? They're like little shark things. Oh, keep rowing. Oh, keep rowing. Just keep rowing. Just keep rowing. Oh, now it's pouring rain too. Oh, this, this is just getting better and better. Okay, that's the first time I've seen those little red shark things. That really, that really kind of sucked. Uh, let's go get this butterfly. Oh, look at that. There's a... Why is there a dead butterfly there? Well, I'm not going to complain. I can eat the wings. That's helpful. The rain kind of comes and goes in this, which is interesting. Okay, so... Let's see. In our food, we can make our crock pot now. If I can get the cut stone out of here. Man, this weather really stinks. Crock pot. All right. Uh, let's build our crock pot down here, I guess. Finally, I have a use for monster meat. Um, let's make some meatballs. All right, I gotta remember what I can actually put in the crock pot to make meatballs. Now this, oh, this monster meat is not in good shape. Um, uh, vegetable, I think I could put, I could put twigs in there, but I actually kind of need twigs. I don't think I have any even anyway. Um, drat. Okay, so I think I could put in like three, three monster meat and a carrot? No. What about fireflies? No. Nope. Butterflies. I can put butterflies in. Uh, oh my gosh, it's actually breaking off the bamboo and sending it flying. It's like a monsoon in here. Here, butterfly. Let's try putting you in the crockpot with these. Let's see, if, let's see if I can make a monster meat or monster meatballs out of this. Uh, butterfly. Cook. I don't know what's going to happen. Hopefully, we don't get the, like, the gray, mushy stuff. We'll find out. I'm getting very wet. All right, let's work on a boat now, because I want to ha have a better boat than what I've been using. Um, we could upgrade to a rowboat, which is better than the raft, but I kind of want to go a little step higher and maybe go with the cargo boat, which has a little bit more room to store things. Uh, we can go with the armored boat, but I don't have any shells. The crusted boat. I think I want to make... So I want to make a cloth sail, and we'll make uh, the cargo boat, but I'm going to need six boards and three rope. And I don't think I have either right now. I got one board. Ooh, I should actually make those healing things too. Um, where is it here? Healing salves. All right, so I can make... Oh, wow, I can make a few of these. How much do they heal for? So I'm at 78 now. If I use a healing salve... 98. Oh, it heals for 20. That's actually pretty good. I'm going to get myself back up to full here. We'll put the rest of the healing salves in here with the rest of this gold. And now we're still at that point where we need twigs. Oh, look, I made a... What did I make? Monster lasagna. Um, I feel like this is probably not going to be good for my sanity. Oh, yeah, that wasn't good. All right, so clearly I don't want to go more than one monster meat in these things. Uh, what can I do for filler in here? If I put, like, one monster meat in... Um, what about petals? Can I put petals in as a filler? No, you can't. See, I'm just not a pro at doing this stuff. I haven't really mastered the whole cooking in this game yet. Which is kind of a big opportunity, I think. Um, if we find some manure here... There we go. Actually, if we use this, we can fertilize this plant. In theory. Fertilize. Nice. So we have a vegetable. So we can put that in. Um, what else? What else? 
I don't think that monster lasagna did good things for my sanity. I seem to be going downhill fast. Oh, look, all the flowers turned back from evil flowers into normal flowers. That's cool. Well, it's daytime again, and my... I, I, I don't know whether it, was, whether it was because I got rained on or because I ate that monster lasagna, but my sanity is really not in a good state now. For the longest time, it was really good. Oh, you know what? I can grab that mushroom, and I think I can use the mushroom to make meatballs. If I'm not mistaken, anyway. Come here, butterfly. Come here. There we go. Oh, another butter. <laughs> I've got three butter now. Just need to look up a recipe to actually cook with it. Uh, so let's go dig up the... We'll grab the mushroom that's up here. It's a red mushroom, but I think if we use it in a recipe, it kind of negates what type it is. And this will let me cook some meatballs, hopefully. Because we definitely don't want monster lasagna again. As long as the meat that's in there didn't go bad. Because it was getting pretty close. Please tell me it didn't rot. Uh, it's spoiled. I don't know. If, I don't know if this is gonna work or not because it's spoiled meat. We'll find out soon enough. Hey, look at that! We succeeded. We have meatballs. Oh, let's grab these, uh, and we'll see. Nice. Let's gobble those up. Wow, that is amazing. That is so much better than all the junk I've been eating. <laughs> okay, so um, let's try and prototype. Actually, I'm gonna need to make some boards first. Um, let's refine these. I'm gonna need, I think, six boards. Well, actually five, because I only have one put away. Um, and then I am going to need rope, which I don't have enough grass for, I don't think. No, I don't have any grass in here, and I only have two on me, so we're going to have to go back go back northward again. Um, now, there is a recipe I know we can make with the eggs in the crock pot, but I think I need regular meat to go with it. So I may not be able to make use of these just yet. All right, so I actually headed out and found some more berries, and I actually dug up the bushes and planted them back here and fertilized them so we can get some berries growing over here, hopefully. I have three berries now. I'm going to try and make waffles in the in the crock pot here. So I gather it takes it takes one butter, uh, one egg, one berry, and then one of anything else. So I'm going to try using butterflies because I, I think... I don't, I don't know if it's going to work or not. We'll cook that up and see what happens. Hopefully we'll get some waffles, and then come morning we'll have something decent to eat. The recipe worked. We made waffles. I actually made three sets of waffles. So we've got uh, we've got all kinds of food now for the moment. Now this actually does more healing, I think, than it does actually replacing food. But it, that works really, actually really well. So I'm gonna keep two of those waffles on hand. Let's head out in a raft and try and go get some more grass. Now I do know there was. Oh boy, we're really sinking here. Down to 37. I should probably be careful about how far I sail with this thing. Because this raft has just about had it. But I know there's some grass around the south side of the island, just in the water, where the water beefalo are. Uh, so we can kind of kill two birds with one stone. We'll get both grass down there and some more manure. Wow, there was a serious spider-snake battle here. That's pretty funny. I don't even need to kill these things. They just kill each other. It's ridiculous, actually. I can get all kinds of spider silk and spider glands this way. Just by leaving them alone. I don't even have to do any work. It's awesome. Well, my poor raft is giving up the ghost. It got all the way down to like 20 some odd percent, or like 20 health or whatever, and I got soaked. Just, just riding around on the raft, because it was like sprung a leak or whatever. I guess it wasn't floating as well anymore, so I got thoroughly drenched, which is now just clobbering my sanity. Not gonna be all the way back down under 100 again. Uh, but on the plus side, we have food. And they were in my backpack, so I don't have waterlogged. I don't have uh, waterlogged waffles. That's something. Uh, I think all the monster meat is now nah, it's now now rotted. So I'm gonna need to work on uh, gathering up some more meat, which means probably hunting some more spiders. But in the meantime, I have enough grass now. We should be able to make some rope. If I can figure out where it is. Oh, it's in the refining thing. That's right. Uh, so I think we need three rope to be able to make that boat. And then we'll go in here and grab the cargo boats. Wait a minute. Did I not make just... I could have sworn I just made three rope. How do I only have two? Whatever. One more. There's the boards. I'm going to grab that and swap it over these flowers. Uh, I did get a little bit more a little bit more manure. Not a lot more. The water beef below there just weren't pooping very well. I guess maybe they just haven't been eating all that great. Uh, now hopefully when we... When we prototype this raft, or this boat rather, it should help with my sanity a little bit too. Use the alchemy lab. There we go. Prototype it. I kind of put it. Oh, it's got to be right on shore. I got it. 
Ta-da! Oh, that helped my sanity a little bit, but not a super ton. That's awesome. Inspect. And it's got six storage compartments in it, which is great. So when I'm out gathering supplies and stuff, I'll be able to carry things around. Uh, now we need to work on a sail. So we can make a sail out of palm fronds, but I don't have that many of them. There's a, I guess it's a thatch sail, but I can make a cloth sail. I have enough cloth for that already. I just need bamboo, which I have lots of. And what else do I need? Bamboo and rope. So hopefully we can make enough rope here. Just barely enough. I'm not going to be able to make a torch, though. And I'm low on wood, so with night approaching, I really should pay... Look at this! It's coming right in my shore. I wish I had a ranged weapon I could attack him with. Uh, but I really should try to get... Oh, no. I'm in big trouble. Um, I ran out of twigs, which means I can't make an axe. Which means I can't get wood. Which means I can't really run my fire for very long. Um... Uh, Somewhere around here, I dropped some pine cones, maybe. If we can find those, I might be able to burn them. This is not good. Oh, wait. I have a shovel. I can get wood that way. Phew. The lack of twigs on this island is really causing a problem for me. Now, there are trees that grow in the water that's down by the water bee flow as well. And the nice thing about them is even after you chop them down, they'll grow back up again. And you get more twigs. But my axe broke while I was trying to harvest them. It's not so good. Okay, that'll last me through the night at least uh, 82 sanity, which isn't fantastic. Ah, but it could be worse. Okay, I have all the materials I need to make the cloth sail, so let's let's get that made. Uh, I'm gonna be near the. There we go. Nice. That wind is getting away now. Okay, so if I take this, can I? How do I equip it on here exactly? I don't, I'm not entirely sure. Okay, I guess they inspected... Oh, look, a light or other enhancement, I guess? Is that what that is? Nice! Sweet! Oh, I could put a light on this thing. That is awesome. I seriously need that. Um, how, do we, how do we make a light for the boat? It'd be nice to use, make it use for these fireflies if I could. Bottle lantern. Glowing ocean goo in a bottle. Use an alchemy engine or sea lab to build a prototype. Use just an empty bottle and some of the bioluminescence. I wonder how you collect the bioluminescence. Boat torch, a boat lantern. There we go. Ooh, I have fireflies. I need an empty bottle. And two twigs, which I don't have any of. Fantastic. But I can make it. That's really cool. All right, I was kind of hoping I could get down and get to that X marks the spot today. So let's go maybe head out, head out that way. We'll try out our new sail on the, on the boat. Um, we've got waffles, so I'm going to eat those. Uh, 94 sanity, which isn't fantastic, but it's better than nothing. Uh, let's put the cloth back in here so I don't have to carry it around. Uh, there is a boat repair kit in here, which I feel like I should probably store in my boat. So if I need it, I know it's there. And we have twigs. No, no, don't take it up. There we go. I can get twigs again. Okay, so now that I have twigs again, I can go and make... Uh, I actually want to make a new backpack because I've been carrying around this horrible one pretty much since I started the game. Uh, I need grass for it, which I don't have. And there's always something. At least I can, though, make a new axe. So that's good. Let's go take, the, uh, take our new cargo boat for a spin. Oh, this is significantly faster. That's awesome. And you have access to the inventory while you're sailing it, which is really cool. <laughs> Go, Wilson. That looks awesome. What do we find here? These look like manta rays. They're even marked on the map. I wonder if you can, like, fish them somehow, like spear fishing or something. That's really cool. I should really make some sort of, like, a, a fishing rod or a trawling net or something so that when I'm sailing around, maybe I can try to get some food for myself. I did eat the last of the waffles. Uh, but my food, my hunger at least is in a good position. And so is our health at the max. Hopefully this island has something good on it. I don't know what the deal is with these X mark the spot things, but we'll find out in a moment, I guess. Ooh, evil flowers here. Oh, gee, I wonder where the X is. I am not, I'm not sure if we can find it. <laughs> um... That's a big beehive there. 
I don't think I want to mess with that thing. Let's just stay away. It's buzzing very loudly, although I would like some honey. Please be good treasure. No kidding. Pick this up. Ooh, we found bone shards. I think we could use those like, for like making a hat. Is that it? Gold shards, or bold shards and one gold doubloon. Oh, that was a terrible treasure. All right. Well, that was kind of a waste. Um, I'm going to take a look at this island while we're down here, I guess. Might as well. Maybe probably the easiest way to do this would be to sail around the outside of it a little bit. Oh, what is this area? I found like a... Oh, it's like a swampy area. Examine flup. What's a flup? Tidal pool. Poisonous hole. Oh, yeah, this looks like a really, in, really inviting place. Totally want to hang out here for the night. There are some uh, some reeds there though, which would be nice to grab. It's gonna be dark soon. I don't have the materials that I need to make a torch, uh, so I do need to make landfall because we're gonna have to set up camp. On the plus side, there's another berry bush here, which I have no place to put. Great. Alright, I have a real problem. Nightfall is about to hit. And if I don't find grass, I can't make a fire. I can't make a torch. I can't do anything. If this island doesn't have grass on it, this is going to be the end of Wilson. No, after we got so far, we made a boat and everything. Had a cool sail on it. That was so cool. Uh, there's lots of these... I don't, I don't like the look of the, all these evil flowers and stuff. And here comes the darkness. <gasps> Fireflies, can I hang out here? Will they leave? No, no. Of course, when I went over there, they, they didn't like it so much. Ah! I can see it. So oh, it's so wrong. No! I got so far. Ah, day 15. Well, we unlocked another character. And wouldn't you know it was grass that did me in of all things? Things were going well. I probably should have taken the boat back to my... Just taking the boat right on back to uh, the camp, and then we might have we might have done a little better there, but sadly things did not end well again. Oh, so much depth in this game. I'm definitely gonna come back and play again, but again I'm, I'm gonna try to advance the game a little bit so that I'm not starting like right at the beginning again. I'll try to get to roughly the same point that I'm at now. We'll try to progress forward. Thanks everyone for checking out the video. I do hope you enjoy these and come back and check out some more. I'm as always Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.